The latest inflation data showing prices rose a worse than forecast 9.1% in June landed minutes before Joe Biden touched down on his first trip to the Middle East. Record high energy prices drove just under half the overall inflation rise. But the US president insists the data is out of date, with gasoline prices in the US dropping by some 32 cents last month, helping to drive down what's called core inflation. And yet that drop is a small percentage, given gas prices in some parts of the country have more than doubled from 2019 pre-pandemic levels. While President Biden is in the Middle East trying to persuade some of the world's biggest oil producers to pump more crude so that in theory the price of gasoline here in the US continues to decline, the inflation crisis is so much more pervasive than that. Typically, when core commodities such as food and oil are stripped out of inflation data, the overall figure looks better. But in June, just about everything from apparel to vehicle insurance witnessed its biggest price rise in a year. And if Biden is trying to stay optimistic, some are starting to tune out. The Small Business Optimism Survey Index that samples how respondents see conditions over the next six months has hit its lowest level for 48 years. Owen Fairclough, CGTN, Washington.